All right, we've got some breaking news out the top at 4 o'clock here. A South Florida man in grave condition after being shot and robbed outside of a home. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Lynn Martinez. And I'm Mike Marzo. Let's get right to 7's Rosh Lowe, live at the scene in Miami with what we know at this point. Rosh. Okay, as you can see behind me, still an active scene, Northwest 44th Street and 6th Avenue. We'll go down the block here a bit. You can see that the crime scene tape still ropes off a large portion of this block. Let's get into our video and I'll tell you what happened according to the city of Miami's police department. They say late this afternoon there was a man and he was supervising some work being done or watching some work being done on the home of a relative. Uh, we are told by uh, some people who know this victim that perhaps they were putting in some windows or hurricane proof windows. It's at that point when according to Miami police that the victim in this case is approached by two males who, who, who will shoot him. They say they take jewelry, cash, and a watch. Let's get into our next piece of video. The victim is transported to Jackson Memorial Hospital. We are told that he is in grave condition. We spoke with uh, a representative from the Miami Police Department. Let's take a quick listen to what they had to say. This moment, uh, the motive uh, appears to be robbery. Uh, we are getting word that they did take a watch from him and possibly some other jewelry and money. Uh, they fled the scene. Okay, so once again, the two suspects in this case uh, fled the scene. Miami police looking for them. But you can take a live look at this scene. This was somebody who was, who was simply just watching uh, work being done uh, on a relative's home. And coming up uh, later today on 7 News, you'll hear from someone who knows the victim talking about what a tragic situation this is. He's simply watching work being done one moment. The next, he is approached. He has cash, his watch, his jewelry taken. Now he's fighting for his life at the hospital. We're live in Miami, Rosh Lowe, 7 News.